We start. <laughs> Ready? Hey guys, uh, back with Abby and Sean here. The, the question is, why after the consultation or that no sweat intro, why does everybody get funneled into that one-on-one -on -one setting, that that one-on-one -on -one, um, atmosphere first? Yeah, so the reason that we go one-on-one -on -one regardless of the consult route, like where we end up there, is the first thing, it, well, we kind of have three stages where we want to understand and implement within the sessions. The first is we run everybody through a movement assessment. So the first thing that we want to identify is joint by joint the how your body functions because we need to understand your body, its potential and its limitations, if any. So we need to understand your body coming into a training environment. Uh, then we also, the one-on-one, -on -one, what's really great about it is the pace of learning. We one-on-one -on -one is a teaching and feedback environment where we t we're teaching a human, another person, how to move and how to move safely, properly, and effectively to get a result or get results. And within that session, we learn their pace, their threshold, because it's different for everybody. And they learn our style, and we learn about that individual, and we learn about the pace that they can learn. And then the third is the scope of their fitness or where they're at and where they want to be. So example could be somebody, their goal is to lose 30 pounds and they come in and you know, th through the one-on-one -on -one sessions, we learn this is their baseline. Like this is where you know, Abby is currently starting and we can then develop the map to get you to where you want to be. Um, and then also it serves as a precursor if group was even a, a thought or an interest for somebody to work out with other people. We again, we, we get the scope, we get the pace of learning, we get the, the understanding of their body because we know it would be a complete disservice and unsafe to the individual to just say, come off the street and hop into this environment which is constantly varied, it's always different, and we don't understand your body, we don't understand how you learn, the pace you learn, you know, the basics. So it's to keep the individual safe, to implement the, the teachings and understand at that level and then gradually build on that based on wherever they want to go, the, the goal, the results, and to implement that, kind of like that teaching, the coaching, that mentorship in this progressive route. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, think, I think you covered it all, and mm -hmm. um, I, I think that's great because if, just like you said, we were setting you up for success, um, instead of just immersing you into a group atmosphere, um, it's just getting to know you more on a, a physical level and a personal level as well. It's just a great opportunity to work one-on-one -on -one with the coaches. Yeah, and, and too, the other thing is if an individual does have specific goals, weight loss, fat loss, strength gain, the fastest path is gonna be individual one-on-one -on -one route. Excuse me. And that is that environment allows, okay, I understand your body, I understand the scope. We can specifically structure that schedule, that time to meet those needs and we have the target it's much faster to get to that result too. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that's great. Thank you, Sean. Yeah. Uh, so in the next video, what we'll do is we'll kind of break down a little bit more about that movement assessment screening. Cool. Great.